Hey guys. So basically, I'm, I like to update everyone on what the heck is going on just in general. Uh, so here's a little bit of a talk, all right? So right now I'm currently using basically all the algorithms are running with around $190,000, all right? It's pretty sick, uh, but there are some issues that we've run into. It's such as the strategy for the high frequency trading algorithm is not working necessarily. It's because of the latency between the algorithm and actually entering the trade, which if you're one to two seconds off, it's pretty bad. But right now it's two sec it's like three seconds off. And that the price change on the second chart moves so fast that it just completely destroys all the profit. Um, Luckily, we were only running with one share on one of the accounts. So this week, we're gonna we're trying to figure out what the heck is going on with that. And once we figure out our next steps to making a high-frequency trading algorithm that works with how fast it is. Also, so my partner, Kyle, he is making a... Uh, well, he's basically developing the strategy at this moment. And... I'm actually working on making it faster. So instead of housing our um, high frequency trading algorithm on think I mean on trading view, we're gonna directly house it on our servers at uh, in Python instead of that. So we can get pretty much instant transmissions because it's on the machine locally. It's not on a server somewhere. Um, the only bad part about that is, um, if like a server goes offline, it's not going to send it. And also it's a ton of work to get it set up for even just one of the computers. Um, but we'll definitely get through it. And uh, yeah. And then also I'm creating a, a uh, we're going to house our own email using our servers, which I don't know. It's kind of cool just being like official, you know, like, um, having a, having like your own email address that comes with an at. And then a, uh, what's it called? A website that comes with it. And yeah, that should all be very fun. And I'm also going to work on the computer learning algorithm and everything. But right now, I'm just going to show you what's going on. So this is the basement, by the way. Um, yeah, just to give you guys a layout, that is, uh, that's where I was making the servers or whatever. I, this is the theater or whatever, but this is the back room. All right. So in here, we have a lot of basically electronics, but mainly overview. The router's up there, power supply, network switch, everything. Uh, then sends out all the power and data information over here. And I know you guys can't feel it, but it's honestly hot in this room because these have been running 24 hours a day. Um, but, I mean, they're still on, and they're still working, as you can kind of hear. Um, backup batteries are working fine. The only, like, one big problem that we've run into is, um, with manually doing this, is that the internet is, I mean, it's fast enough, but it's not fast enough. So, I'm trying to figure out a way to get uh, fiber wire directly into the back of each machine because right now how the server layout is set up is that all of these servers are connected to the switch right here then they're communicating through the switch but they're using just regular wires if we were using fiber optic cable and then just routed them in the back of every single one it could make a direct transmission and not have to go through here uh, cutting I'm estimating about half a second out of transmission time which means instead of taking seven days to um, for the computer learning algorithm to fully work, it'll be taking about uh, four, three, five days. Because, I mean, that's honestly the biggest issue for the computer learning algorithm is time-wise. It can't run constantly. And people with a lot of, with big servers can constantly run a computer learning algorithm that fixes all the changes and everything. But for me, I don't have that much money and I don't have that much graphics power. So I'm just going to be purely running off of seven days. So 
If we can shorten the time where it takes to do a full cycle of computer learning, that'd be great. And yeah, it's basically just that. But all right, so that's basically what's going on. I like to keep you guys updated, but party hard. Just tell me what's going on. <laughs> See ya.